friends uh how are you doing it's quite good to connect with you again um i just wanted to come in here really quick and show you a really cool mod uh someone i've connected with over the internet his name is andy alp and he runs a uh business called alp services and he uh does console modding and he refurbishes mo um consoles i sent him an, uh, an og xbox that was completely damaged and non-working and he refreshed the circuit boards and did all of his tricks and he actually even added like a bazillion games to it and it, he actually the tray uh face of the tray the disc tray was missing and he replaced that which i didn't ask him to do thought that was really cool of him to do that going above and beyond um i like that so i, I have this had this old game boy laying around it's a dmg game boy it was the uh, in a very rough shape. It was wet when I found it. I think I found it at a yard sale in a bundle and it was completely damaged. It would power on sometimes, but it's not a hundred percent reliable. And uh, I said, hey, um, I didn't know he did Game Boys. And I said, hey, I'd like to do a case swap and new buttons. And I actually opted to keep the original screen. I just like that original look. Uh, I do have, you know, if I wanted to play a Game Boy game and the best, you know, quality or best experience, I have the RG36S to the right here. I can always emulate it on the RG36S, which is a tremendous emulation console. Highly recommend you buy one. They're about 40 bucks. I freaking love it. And the screen is like the um, IPS display and it looks so good. Uh, and it is also an atomic purple. So I asked him to do this in atomic purple. Uh, it's my favorite color. I associate the atomic purple color with the 90s. I had a GBA uh, in atomic purple. I had an N64 controller in atomic purple. Uh, I am looking for an N64 console in atomic purple. I have not found one yet. Maybe I'll do a case swap myself. Uh, looks like it's maybe relatively easy to do. But anyway, so back to Andy, and he asked, hey, um, you know, would you take a crack at it? And he's like, well, I got to find a case on eBay. And I told him I wanted Atomic Purple, and he found one that wasn't quite Atomic Purple. It's more like clear. Uh, but this is what it came out to be, and it actually looks Atomic Purple. So it, it couldn't have turned out better, and I'm so happy. Um, so I just got it in today. He did a great job. He refreshed the circuit boards. He put new buttons on it. He did a case swap. He put, and this part wasn't here before, so he put that there. Again, I did not do a screen uh, swap. It was like $85 more. And again, I have that over there if I actually want to play a Game Boy game in a high quality setting. So I'm good. I actually prefer the old school feel of barely seeing the screen. And so here it is. I wanted to show it off to you. I'm going to turn it on here. Again, the screen is just the original screen. Uh, look at that. I mean, you know, not bad at all. Not bad at all. And he did do, a, he did re uh, replace the wheel that does the contrast that he said was in rough shape. But there it is. Sounds great, doesn't it? I like that you can see through everything. Uh, a surprise of me, of mine, when I first opened this was you can see through and see the original card. How cool is that? You can see the batteries. You can see, I have, actually have a hack. This is like a hack. Pokemon Green, apparently it's like from Japan or something, I don't know. But um, anyways, I love that you can see the cart through the case. The case looks so good too, look at that. I mean, it could not have turned out a better color. And compared to the RG36S, almost, uh, I mean, the color is pretty, pretty darn close. But I love this console i love how i mean even the screen looks better now that it's refreshed that it's got a new case a new life let me tell you i don't have a picture of the original but this looked like utter tra i actually almost trashed thing or gave put the goodwill but i said you know what let me see if my boy andy will take care of this. i was thinking about doing it myself but i have zero patience to do this kind of stuff um, i think it's kind of cool that he does it I could probably figure it out. I like tinkering with things, but he's already helped me with my OG Xbox. And I said, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and hit him up. Uh, he gave me a good quote and it was well worth it. Money well spent, my friend. I will link his shop below. He's on Facebook and a uh, really friendly guy, really good dude. Um, no complaints whatsoever. His work is solid and oh my gosh. 
this is gorgeous. Even without the upgraded screen, it looks it looks better. This is the original screen, and it looks better now. So this is awesome.